welcome back here on today we will discuss about how to calculate the lsd basically lsd is a land surface temperature so in this video we will discuss how to calculate the land uh, surface temperature for this purpose you need pan 10 pan 11 uh, basically i am using the land set 8 images the methodology for land set 8 and the land set 9 is almost same uh, for this purpose you need to uh, do pan 10 pan 11 and uh, there is a one uh, factor uh, uh, that is NDVI. In calculating the LSD, uh, it's uh, for this purpose you need to band five and uh, band four. Uh, these are your data that are required for calculating the LSD. Uh, I am clip my uh, study area for band ten and band eleven, and uh, uh, this is band four and band five. Uh, uh, first, we are going to calculate the NDVI. For this purpose, you need to go uh, here and search a tool named as a raster calculator. Open this tool. I write here equation. Okay. The equation is that you need to enter the floor band 5 minus band 4 divided by floor band 5 plus band 4. Uh, how to add this float? Uh, you can scroll down this from here. There is a function name as a float. Double click on it. It is added here. Uh, you need to give their output location. Uh, it's depend upon your directory. My directory is this. I copy it and paste here. Okay. Okay. Uh, run the tool. You can also define the environment from here. Go to the environments, go to the processing extent, default. Here you can select the uh, similar as a culture. Uh, culture is basically a study area. And then go to the roster analysis. Then select here from uh, mask. And this is uh, your mask file. And hit the OK button, then click on OK. It take few minutes in the running the tool. Okay, the tool uh, is finally done and your NDVI is calculated. After calculating the NDVI, you, uh, you uncheck these two files and uh, click here to zoom to layer. Uh, this is your basically NDVI. You can also give a code color ramp for this. Okay, okay, where uh, there is an NDVI, it is colored in a dark. Uh, green and this is the build up area basically this is the urban areas where the ndvi values is our maximum or minimum okay now we are going to calculate uh, lsd okay uh, for this purpose you need to go search tool and here is one tool name as a raster calculator okay higher higher mentioned the one thing is that uh, you can see that in this picture the band 10 is a thermal infrared and uh, band 11 is also thermal infrared bands so uh, so the basically uh, thermal bands are used to calculating the nt uh, lst okay here you can input the first equation of lst the first equation is uh, calculating the band radiance for this purpose you need to copy these values and paste here in your raster calculator okay here you can enter your band 10 uh, this is band 10 okay and same these values and uh, file named as uh, the name of the file is where band and variance copy this name you can also paste here save okay run the tool this is the band and radiance and then go to the results tool then click here go to the raster calculator then you just need to change the band from here, band uh, 11, and then click here. Change your name from band 10 to band 11, then run the tool. Basically, uh, we have calculated the band radiance for band 10 and band 11. Okay, the next step is that uh, to calculate band 10 set temperature and band 11 set temperature, it is basically uh, satellite temperature for band 10 and band 11. For this purpose, you write this equation. Uh, copy this equation from here and uh, go to the raster calculator. Here you need to 
write this equation and change this form here to input this uh, this file then give its output name you can write this as an output name okay uh, then hit the okay button okay the tool is done completely then you can uh, uh, go to calculate band 10 set uh, band 11 set temperature go to the raster calculator and you need to copy this equation for band 11 okay enter this equation here you need to change this band 11 radians okay give the output name copy this and paste here the output raster name is band 11 set temperature hit the ok button okay finally uh, the band set temperature for band 11 and uh, band 10 set temperature is calculated uh, then you need to search here a tool name and cell statistics cell statistics hit the enter button then go to this tool it's available in a spatial analyst toolbar then here you need to add these two files band 11 set temperature and band 10 set temperature and select here the mean okay hit the okay button it is calculated the mean values of land surface temperature okay Finally, the mean values of the land surface temperature is minimum is 10 and the maximum is 222.1084. So next, uh, you need to go here and go back the raster, open the raster calculator. And here you need to write the uh, next equation. Uh, here you need to write this equation. Okay, for this equation, you need to add square it is available here scroll down this is the scale here you need to add your in calculated ndvi this one uh, okay this one you need to add ndvi okay then plus then add the minimum this is the minimum value so you here write minus 0 0.05 then next is divided by max value minimum value divide bracket the max value is this 0 0.49 0 0.49 and then minus it from uh, this value so basically here is plus because it's a mathematics rule minus minus is equal to plus so you here write to 0 0.05 okay name this file as a pv pv stands for propagation vegetation okay we need to go here and add pv okay save it and run the tool okay finally your pv is also calculated then we are going to calculate the uh, next step next step is e emissivity basically e is the emissivity the radiation that are emitted from earth surface uh, okay go here and uh, go here then click on raster calculator then paste this paste these values here then you go to this and here you need to select this file and uh, its name as land emissivity surface save and then hit the ok button ok the tool is successfully run then we are going to apply the final equation for land surface temperature then the final equation is this one 
copy it and uh, paste here replace this from then 10 set temperature okay the next one is pan 10 here you need to input pan 10 okay this one is pan 10 here you need to input pan 10 set temperature then okay then here you write its output name okay, save it okay there is a error uh, map algebraic expression error 